It was one of those days where you could get outside, play a little soccer, watch the game on the swings. Yeah, that kind of day. Buffalo versus Jackson, this game being played in Casper. First half, Jackson wearing the white. Will Horseman knew it was early, and he decided to give it a shot, but Neil Metters was more than ready for that one. He needed something to keep him on his toes, and he'd keep that ball out of the net. It took about 25 minutes or so before anything else happened, and that's when Mitchell Wilcox decided to go on a one-man stampede for the Bison. He would keep the ball on the ground and send it right through the legs of Creel Smith and into the back of the net for the goal. That's good ball handling and fast thinking. Buffalo's on the board first, up 1-0. The defending 3A state chance for trying to tie things up. Horseman will take a closer shot this time and take the high road, but Metters was able to reach up and get a hand on that ball and knock it out of bounds. That saved a point for the boys in black, who were doing well considering it was their first game of the season. The Bronx kept trying. They would go for the crisscross routine, set it up in one direction, and knock it in the other way. Good thought, but the aim was off just a little bit as the Bison would maintain their 1-0 lead going into halftime. Second half, both teams now going in the opposite direction. Jackson was turning up the pressure. Juan Marian slips the ball through the defense to Miguel Cortez, and Metters had to act fast, which he did to break it up. The rebound try would hit the side of the net and go out of play, and Buffalo would dodge a bullet on that one. However, a short time later, the boys in black got called for a trip in the box. Marian is on for a penalty kick try for the Bronx. He would go one way, and Metters went in the other direction. The result is a wide-open goal, the third of the season from Rion, in which all of them are from the line. This game is tied at one. Later, here they come again. Horseman draws the double team to him, and that meant Tristan Wagner was open. The freshman will put a little lift on the ball to get it over Metters and in for what turned out to be the game winner. The opposition gave it a good effort in this early season clash of heavyweights, but Jackson prevailed in the end, 2-1. to one.